Okay, next I'm going to assemble these two together. So what I do is I take the nut and kind of twist it in there so it kind of holds itself in that loop when you uh, made the wire. It's basically going to go into that cap. This is kind of the putty part because the little bolts are going to want to push those through. Like that. So there, set that onto there. Then I'm going to take a little get bit of goop because I want that nut, that first nut to sit in there and stay. And I'm also kind of sealing up what I think could be a little hole along those threads. Don't want any of that HHO gas coming out from these. These are just a little bit rusted. That's why they're a different color. Nothing, nothing scary there. that you can see is on there nice and tight for your electrical where I'm just going to show you what goes on there okay so there we go there's the there's the pieces okay next we're, I'm going to show you a gasket um, inside that cap you want to make a gasket and what I found is this material, this is actually the liner that they put when they're in the bottom lock of a building a shower when they pour that. And what I did is this is, the, it's nice and thin material. Uh, what I found is to take a kern lid, set it down on top of that material, and cut just a little bit wider. Set your blade just kind of at an edge, at an angle, to go around that kern lid. And then in the middle, I used a can of dog food, and I cut tight to the inside of that. The main idea is that you need to have this big enough so that when it goes inside the cap, it'll stay inside there. So when you fit it down in there, when you turn it over, it's not going to fall out. Okay, so you have your cap and the core. They're all assembled. You have your gasket on the inside. So that has that goop on there. Let that sit up for 24 hours. And at that point, then you're ready to go ahead and put that into your uh, solution with your baking soda and to put your electricity to it or test it or whatever you're going to do. But you're ready to move on to the next step.